I know the world changes, I know it seems hard I know we get knocked down from going too far It's always day one when I struggle the most But I know I'm doing better when I'm living with hope I need you all to sit and try to listen a minute Don't worry about stressful pieces of life for a minute I know you got problems in life, man, I get it I said it all the world. Uh, so here's your rap therapy news, volume 3, version 3 Vlog 3, however you want to talk about it or think about it <clears throat> Today I'm going to start off by talking about the Fiverr account. Go over there, check it out. We got the ultimate branding experience. Uh, if you want to build your brand vision or mission, that's this is definitely the way to do it. So get in there while you still can. <clears throat> um, we'll be uh, we're going to be expanding our product services and lineups as we go. So we're always going to be um, offering something and. Uh, keep evolving and offering something more and different and expanding. Uh, it takes time to develop new products and new concepts, so you know, just keep an eye out. If there's something that you're interested in seeing come from us, let us know. That'd be great. Today's first topic, I know I wrote Donald Trump policy. I'm not talking about Donald Trump. <clears throat> I'm not even really concerned about his policy, but I am going to mention The Economist put out today an article titled Nothing to do with the article, just the title said, Donald Trump's proposed budget will gut America's social safety net. Now, anybody who's into mental health, social work, um, <clears throat> health of nations, uh, and, and happiness, you know that the social safety net is an important factor in preventing people from falling just to the bottom and being forgotten. So the social safety net is important. Uh, especially for modern society. We can't just let people fall to the bottom. I'm not going to talk about Trump. I'm going to talk about the impact of what Trump does because we are more powerful than the president. What we do as human beings will always be more powerful. We just have to decide that's what we want to do. We can either let decisions go to, the, to whoever is president or we could take that back to us. So to me... If Trump's policies attack the social safety net, that's opportunity for happiness. That's opportunity. Because we, as human beings, can take accountability for that again. We can spend time with folks. One thing that's also critical is my buddy Gary Ackley. Uh, someday we're going to do a podcast called We Always Agree, Except When We Don't. Because we always agree, except when we don't. But he posted a awesome meme that says... While we spend four to eight years worrying about who's in the White House, there's 30 and 40 year career politicians in Congress. And then there's the money tree above that. And, you know, the speculation is that they own all of those people. So the president is so far down the chain of power that focusing on the, the, the front man is not going to help anything. But we can help. So keep that in mind. One of the ways that we can help and the way that we can get that power back as people, as human beings, is to make a decision. You're always one decision away from a totally different life. Your life can change right now and become different. And you can decide that. That's critical and important. One of the ways that we can make a decision that supports the future of our country is caring. Caring will immediately double somebody's durability. You take somebody who no one cares about and you add one caring person and it will double their ability to achieve whatever it is they're trying to do in their life. Believe me, I've seen it over and over again and I've had a couple experiences in the past few days that just verify and double down on that idea. Just one caring person. Including our kids. Every kid is one caring adult away from being a success story. And believe me, there are forgotten human beings. <clears throat> for whatever reason. They do it to themselves. They end up in the wrong situation. They move. Circumstances. Environment. It doesn't matter. There are kids that are thriving because they have at least one supportive person. That means that 
that success comes from an ecosystem, from a, a community. Find the kids that don't have that and care about them. Show them caring acts. You don't need anything in return for that. You just know that Hopefully, your karma, perhaps, will come back and support you in the same way. How do you care about a kid? You know, what's something that you can do? Because caring is just this random thing. So, there are steps to do that. Look up caring online. And you can even look up the quote. And I'm going to share a story with you in the comments um, from a website that talks about this. But the quote is everywhere. Every kid is one caring adult away from being a success story so seek that out you're going to find steps but here they talk about identify one kid that then consistently and intentionally invest time with that one kid do it on purpose make it a to-do list all right that one change in our culture will eliminate a need for services and a social safety net for that person because we're so we're providing them a social service a community service to support them to grow by investing that one thing all right some of the other tips don't get discouraged you, you can't get discouraged because there are no expectations the only expectations are on yourself to offer something to someone <clears throat> let them know the potential that you see in them. I promise you, there are no human beings with zero potential. It is impossible to find someone with zero potential. Now, if you're skeptical, you might say they don't fit in the construct that we have. But there is a success potential in everyone. It might not be your success or a, a currently defined success, but they can become successful. All right. Uh, time. That's the key. Uh, all of the problems that we see, every time I see a news story about, um, especially lately, terror attacks are the top story. And every time I see one, I think that person didn't get the, the time they needed from someone. They got time from someone with the wrong ideas. They needed time with people to be accepted into a tribe and a culture that was different than the one that they were in. So the time that we spent with whoever that was, whatever, whatever the bad thing that they did, there was a period of time before the event that could have been changed by spending time with that person. We, we don't always have the time to spend with everyone, but if more people... We can eliminate and reduce so many of these acts by just spending meaningful time with people, and including kids. Um, <clears throat> and that's the mountain that's in front of us right now. Every mountain, there's a path on the other side of it. You can't see it from this side, but on, if you climb the mountain, you could see the path. And that's, that's how you can just focus and achieve on every level. Uh, and just to tie this all in and to close you up on the rap therapy news today, uh, the Tavistock Institute, if I'll put that, I'm going to put this link in the, in the comments. Uh, they're a major think tank and they look at social engineering and, and all of that. So if, if you have any question that we have the ability to impact the future, starting with kids, spending meaningful time, finding people that are outside of the social norm. Uh, and spending meaningful time with them and increasing that and taking our free time to do that because it's not free time. And there's no such thing as free time because you're going to pay for that time. If you don't spend it meaningfully with people in your community and <clears throat> and seeking out the, the people who are falling below the social safety net, then it's going to cost society. So figure out how to engage um, but the Tavistock Institute has uh, a, a study that they did that's published May 2017. First results of the NEETS at-risk project, N-E-E-T-S. And NEETS stands for Not in Education, Employment, or Training. Okay? 
These are people that are not engaged in society, that have found no avenue, have found no path. And this think tank sits down and they try to, well, they successfully engineer the, the structure to support the people who are falling below that, the, the neat kids. Uh, and so that article is going to be posted below if you're more interested in that. But honestly, this is this is this problem starts with Tavistock, and then months later, after these publishings are already out, you'll start to hear little hints of these things in the news, but not solutions to the problem, just highlighting these problems um, and letting you know that they exist and that you have to worry about them. Both well, stop worrying and start doing. That's the Rap Therapy news for today. Uh, and, and as always, uh, Rap Therapy LLC is a life with happiness company. We're here for music and media um, production. We focus on empowerment, mental health, recovery, and veteran support. And I hope that if you don't join our mission, that you start your own with all of those same tenants involved. And you take a look at think back on the links that are below and everything we talked about today and you make your life better always remember the future that shines brighter than right now stick to the vision pick a direction the world that you live in is only limited by the thoughts that you have so think of success think of the best opportunity make it a script or like a movie in your mind find a reality call it grit predict your own future insist on living a life you'll never regret never let anyone get at you and tell you it's wrong more than a little bit failing a few times is how you The only thing I care about is how you stay motivated I know the world changes, I know it seems hard I know we get knocked down from going too far It's always day one when I struggle the most But I know I'm doing better when I'm living with hope I know the world changes, I know it seems hard I know we get knocked down from going too far It's always day one when I struggle the most But I know I'm doing better when I'm living with hope Knowing better doesn't make it better for real Better to deal with a problem in the moment face to face Stick with a plan that you mapped out if you fall off the wagon and reach out, I'm there.